I made this video a while back and you guys loved it, so here's more tips if you're still stuck trying to find a gamertag. Tip 1. Go to Platinum.com and choose gamertag. I just chose random because both masculine and feminine are really similar. Open up a Google Doc or Notepad and write down the names you like. I like to get a baseline from this and add on to it. So I found Ghastly King and Atli and Teen, whatever that means. You can mix and match those. So let's say your name's Jack. You can kind of match these as well. Again, this is if you literally have no idea where to start. I wouldn't recommend adding numbers unless it shows personality. Numbers just doesn't look clean unless you're trying to go for a funny or personalized look. Next is tobyses.com. Just copy and paste any symbols if your game allows it. I like this because you can show some creativity and personality without making your name unrecognizable or cluttered. They even make letters that you can substitute for your name. I don't recommend this website for long names, however, mainly because it's already long and you really don't want to use more space. Some games don't support special characters, so beware of that. Next, go to wordnick.com and search for four letter words. There are some really cool words that you can add to your name or even make up a whole name. Some words obviously don't match each other, but here are some that I came up with. You can put your name into this too, if you can't find two matching ones you like. You can even pair this with the first tip. There are a lot of weird words as well, but I think it's still worth taking a look at. You can also do this with five or three letter words. I just did this with four because it's short. I also chose this because not many people heard of all these words, and plus, they're really unique and stylish. Next is just a funny name for games. Make up something stupid like, like Toe Clippers or No Life Loser if you don't want to get too serious about a game. People will think you're just a funny person. I've actually noticed more positive energy as well as friend requests using these names. Alright, next is more of a mistake. I don't like it when people use underscores or an X in their name. Not only is it messy, but it's also not really memorable. What makes you unique compared to all the other players named Ninja for example? I could even name 5 YouTubers with Ninja in their name. Think of something personal like your name, something you like, or something funny to add to that. Don't just copy a popular name and put an underscore next to it to try to get the name. Instead, I would recommend adding special characters from before or think of a new name altogether. I would guarantee that it would look cleaner and more memorable. Next, I want to share popular streamers names. Okay, so Tim has tats, and that's really prevalent in his name. Dr. Lupo, it shows his personality, and the name is only six letters. Nick Merckx probably just made his name in six seconds, to be honest. Shroud and Ninja are really good names, and were one of the early pro players, so they probably just got the name before everyone else. XQC plays Overwatch, which is OW in his name. Tommy in it is just a really funny name because it describes his personality. Next here are some names that you can make up depending on which game you play. Adding LOL for League, CS for Counter-Strike, FN for Fortnite. In my opinion, these are just tryhard names, but hey, you can use them if you like. Next, think of ways you can customize a name you chose from before. Think of adding or removing letters if your name is already taken. Your game attack should be about you, even if it's clean or has a bunch of letters. You should do whatever you feel like suits you. This video is just a guide for what you can do if you have no idea whatsoever or no path. Thanks for watching this continued version of Finding Gamertag.